Want to raise your chest to a new level? Challenge Yourself is an exclusive, innovative experience designed for Chess24 Premium members. Train like a champ with a unique set of lessons prepared by the coaches of the challengers. Boris Gelfin and Co. will help you improve your chess. Play a champ. Play a grandmaster each day in Banter Blitz. Take advantage of this incredible opportunity from June 10th. Go premium and challenge yourself. Take your chess to the next level with carefully selected collections featuring some of the best video series from Chess24. Buy the courses to own them forever, save up to 60% or go premium and access all series while having all other privileges of premium membership. Learn more at chess24.com slash deals. Hello everyone, welcome to another Banter Blitz session. With I, I am Hari Krishna and uh, today I'm going to accept challenges from uh, the premium members of Chess24 and the time control could be 3 plus 0, 3 plus 2, 5, plus, 5, uh, 5 0 or 5 plus 2, uh, but not 10 minutes and uh, above or not even bullet. Uh, so. Uh, any of these time controls, uh, you're welcome to challenge. And obviously, I have many challenges, so I will take um, one at a time. Of, and um, yeah, so let's let's get started. Um, all right. Yeah, and a big hello to um, all the viewers um, on Twitch, YouTube, and on Chess24. Um, so you can write questions uh, where, whichever platform you uh, you like to use. Uh, I hope I can answer some of them at least. Um, okay, I'm just trying to play uh, against uh, anyone. Uh, okay, let's see. Let's go with. So I'm playing against Ism Ismir Tulum, and I have white pieces. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's go e4. Oh, that's French. So let me use my uh, my course. Let's see what he has. Okay, D takes E4. I think uh, this is what I have suggested. Uh, it's quite solid, quite solid for black. And I believe knight E5 is the move. So how are you guys doing? Yeah, I'm playing the online Olympiad. Uh, it starts uh, from day after tomorrow. Actually, it did start uh, already, but... Uh, Yeah, thanks, <laughs> thanks, Iron Matt. I will. Uh, yeah, <laughs> oh, wonderful, <laughs> wonderful chat. I, I like, I like what I see there. Um, yeah, indeed, I, I had a wonderful time uh, commenting with Ginger GM. Hi, Blender Panda. Hi, hi, everyone. <laughs> yes, now I kind of. I'm trying to figure what 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 was my point of this whole thing. Okay, bishop d3. So of course, queen d4 fails to bishop b5 check. And why can't I have twitch? Ah, 
I'm in the wrong one. Okay. So bishop d3, of course, d takes c5, bishop takes c5 and short castle. Yeah, just normal position so far. Uh, queen f3, bishop g5. Uh, that's that's a, that's a normal setup. Uh, of course, one needs to be careful. Okay, I lost a lot of time actually, but it's five minutes, so I'm not so much worried here. Yeah, Jonathan, of course, uh, Anand has achieved uh, everything he, he could in, in the chess world. And obviously for every player from India, it's a big motivation, you know. Um, so B6, I mean, this is quite risky, but uh, I would like to go Queen F3 and go some attack immediately. So which chart should I follow? I mean, I have like three chats here. Hi, must lose this to this. Okay, queen d5 is nice. Uh, if bishop takes f6, queen f3, that's the idea, of course. Um, but what happens if I go queen h3? Or queen g3? Queen g3, knight h5, yes. Okay, let's go for this. Um, why would Carlson play today? I mean, the tournament is over. Yeah, uh, yeah, please don't tell the most. But I mean, yeah, queen h3 is nice. The idea is after queen e5, bishop f6, and uh, it's a um, mistake made. I expect him to play knight e4. Oh, maybe I shouldn't tell it out loud. Loud. Okay, so I don't have many moves here. Bishop e4, queen e4, rook e1, he has queen f5. Okay, let's defend this. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Uh, highest rated chess engine I have ever beaten. Uh, I'm not sure. I have, I have actually, uh, well, maybe uh, like long time ago, uh, some deep junior kind of a things, but recently none. All right, let's go. The idea is of course, if he moves the knight from e4, then I want to checkmate. Yeah, for now I made uh, the end game course. I really liked it's uh, one like, of course, other two courses are also my favorite, but this is special course and uh, uh, opening course, uh, perhaps after some time, uh, as I have a um, couple of events until October, the Grand Swiss is in October. So after that, I will think about it. What do you what do I think about Adiban's D3? <laughs> I think it's well, it's uh, I mean it depends on what level you are playing. Of course, if you like to play something funky, then uh, you should you should get it. And why not? Um yeah, I Okay, um, so here I see bishop c4 is quite nasty. Um, okay, let's do it. 
Yeah, at this time, uh, um, uh, all the players are uh, playing from one place in Chennai. That's really nice to have it. Uh, unfortunately, I couldn't attend. Alpha Zero or Stockfish? I mean, how does it matter? <laughs> both are good. Yeah, both of them are so good. Okay, Night G6. Yeah, I have been training, obviously, uh, even oh, actually Rook D1 was possible, but no. Um, okay, so let's take this. And now it's time to play something simple. Yeah, Anish uh, tweets are quite uh, funny and, uh, you know, sometimes he's... Uh, He's questioning some things in a sarcastic way, sarcastic way, so it's good. Uh, am I going to do more commentary with Ginger Jim? I have no idea. Uh, right now, uh, Ginger is doing uh, a lot of commentary with, uh, with, uh, with Danny and uh, it's going great, so. So tell me which part of uh, the game do you, uh, I mean, viewers like in general, like end game, middle game, or opening? Should not blunder checkmate though. Nepo <laughs> tweet. Yeah, Nepo tweet is also interesting, you know, like uh, uh, he, uh, he, he expresses it, it in a very, um, straightforward or let's put it a bit direct in, 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 uh, to public taste. So uh, we'll see. I, I think uh, he's, he's a good guy. Yeah, my friends call me Hari. That's correct, Beast. Oh, you're not the Z Beast. Um, I, I have no idea who's, I mean, I would say, uh, Magnus is uh, the favorite, um, but uh, I think, uh, Nepo will fight, Nepo will fight and uh, we'll have a great, great, uh, match. And, uh, Chat, this is for premium members. Uh, so, okay, I, I haven't played with fair play. So let's be fair and play against him. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's nice for the viewers to see grandmasters playing uh, you know, dumb or slightly inferior or even dubious. Uh, but the player who is losing, I don't think he he or she feels very good about it. <laughs> I'm currently in the Czech Republic. Yeah, so usually white uh, wastes the move uh, in reaching this position by playing rook u on d5. Uh, since I did not have to play that, uh, it's slightly, you know, in favor for me. Maybe knight b5 was a better move. Nevertheless, I, I like white's position. So after b takes c5, uh, black would like to play d4. So let's go knight h4 with the idea knight f5. Also knight takes d5 is a threat. And of 
uh, black can't play d4 because the g2 bishop will capture the bishop on d7. Yeah, yesterday I, I was uh, I was commenting along with Danny and uh, uh, Simon on chess 24. It was fun. We had uh, very interesting games, of, of course. Yeah, I'm going to get this uh, e7 bishop. So at least I have two bishop pair. There was a funny question. Uh, the question is, why do uh, grandmasters change their houses often? I don't know what he means. <laughs> Who is doing that? I guess uh, um, over a period of time, uh, a lot of juniors and their juniors, and you know, it's a kind of a chain. So slowly, uh, now we have uh, pretty strong players, and I, I expect more of them to come in uh, near future. Um, I believe when the bar is uh, going higher uh, with every year. So then you get more and more strong juniors. That's that's what I can think about. Have my reach? I don't know. I have no idea. So knight b3 is uh, one nice way to put it, and knight d4. But then black has bishop a4. That's a kind of problem here. So. What should we do? What should we do? Okay, anyway, let's do this. I have many of them. Uh, I like uh, Capablanca. Then uh, many world champions play amazing and Magnus, of course. Um, so a lot of, lot of uh, great players. Okay, so actually my opponent is playing pretty good. So far it's he's doing good, but one can never know when things will turn. I need to take control of the C5. I think this 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 should be my aim. Yeah, and I'm going to get that. And now you know all kinds of threats with bishop h5 or rook d4. So yeah, just too many threats. Now rook f8 is kind of necessary. And now he needs to play knight d7. And now he needs to play knight e5. And now he needs to play that, this. Yeah, and rook f5 should be uh, the finishing touch. Not yet, he's fighting. Okay, let's take another pawn. I mean, here, for example, everything wins. All I should not, I should be doing is just playing fast. Ah, he wants to flag. Okay, let's do this. Okay, I haven't played against Jonathan Russell, so let's play against him. Uh, which airport am I arriving? Uh, I, I know I'm not. Um, so uh, everyone who is wishing uh, me for uh, the online Olympiad, thanks a lot. I will try my best and do my best. On strategy, okay. Uh, 
for a moment i lost what i wanted to play here and one thing i a general advice is that when before you analyze your own games or before you analyze anything try not to switch on the computer at once first try to figure what you wanted to play where did you go wrong by yourself and then only you turn on the engine and i think that uh, could be one way to improve your uh, middle game i certainly benefited uh, by doing that you know if you start uh, the engine before you even think about the position that's not going to be good why should i pick between david hovell and simon williams <laughs> they are both good i think they have their own style and uh, yeah yeah both are quite different from each other so no i am not going to pick on that uh i think what he meant was uh, having 20 30 moves and equalizing or 0.00 which you oh look at this the, the queen is trapped wow after 30 moves yeah so therefore i think uh, for lower rated players you first need to like uh, the opening which you are studying and uh, it's it's so important that uh, you need to feel like okay i i enjoy playing this and uh, that's the most important thing not which is more popular not which is uh, in the current uh, you know trend and stuff like that yeah i mean yeah he just missed it of course uh, it it happens sometimes yeah he missed it yeah i do hope that uh, like um, players who are lower rated uh, will try to think on their own first and only then uh, switch on the engine kya <laughs> haal hai बहुत अच्छा है केचप और मेयो ओके प्रॉब्ली इट्स गोना बी इट्स टफ इट्स एक्चुअली टफर देन आई थॉट मेयो yes yes i am i am going to play uh, uh i'm going to play uh, in european club cup <laughs> yeah that was actually i was uh, maybe commenting on chess 24 india at that point uh, it was uh, it was a big fight it was a big fight and uh, definitely um, there were chances uh, but uh, this king h1 move i still remember which namaste bhai log kaise ho aap log no no i am not playing uh... yeah there are the upcoming classical events like i said uh, it will be european club cup followed by polish league and then uh, uh grand swiss thank you cfa 101 what's that so here uh, we want a pawn 
and uh, have nice center. Of course, black is slightly better developed. He already, you know, castle. So I should be, I should be careful. Yeah, exactly. He he goes for it. Bishop f4. Yeah, I, I think, uh, no, I cannot really sacrifice. So bishop d3 is what I would play. Bishop e3, f takes e3, queen h4. <laughs> yeah, I'm playing. I don't know why people are even asking this question. I'm playing Olympiad. Uh, people uh favorite chess commentator i don't know i mean there are so many it's it's hard to pick and i will forget uh for sure one of them Uh, bullet certainly not. Uh, I would go with uh, classical and rapid. Blitz is also fine, uh, except bullet. Everything is fine. Yeah, now I stop this queen g two and uh, long castle. It's pretty much winning. Also knight g five. Yeah, queen h3 and also rook on f8 is stopping, but uh, I'm going to castle anyways, so I castle. And knight g5 can be done any moment, so I'm not really worried here. I think white is winning already here. A pawn up with nice knight on e4 should be winning. So b6, knight g5, uh, what's the point? Queen h6, yeah. Okay, anyway, it's good to go knight g5, I think. So queen h5 or queen h6. Uh, it depends on the position, you know. If I have a better end game, uh, then I will play for, the, uh, play for win. If he has, uh, of course, he is going to push for win. So it, many of these things depend on uh, what kind of position we are playing? Uh, I could take also. I can. I could have played h4, so it really doesn't matter. What you do in? Uh, what do I do in my free time? I I like to play sport actually, and uh, also I, I I like to sit uh, outside and just to think. You know, I'm a thinker. <laughs> Yeah, and one thing I really like is when I'm uh, re resting outside, I like to just um, uh, visualize the openings or ideas so that uh, I can remember well. Maybe that's a good way of uh, remembering. Uh, you can uh, challenge uh, three, three, zero, three plus two, five, zero, five plus two. Some of them, I think, mostly five. Knight h3, yes, but I want to go knight e6, rook f7, and exactly this is the reason, knight d8. Isn't it a nice trick? Of course, I'm not uh, winning yet, because after rook f8, rook b8, my knight is trapped on b7. <laughs> it's no problem, same guy. By the way, why did you uh, have, why do you, uh, I mean, why did you have the handle sad guy? I mean, nothing wrong, just I'm curious. Yes, this, this is over now. I'm a pawn up plus uh, an exchange up. So it's all good. We have, we are under control. Hmm. Okay. 
Okay, this is uh, this is a unnecessary fight by my opponent. If he uh, if he takes the rook, uh, I was going to take knight h6, g takes h6, and king d1 uh, with two pawns up. It's winning. Not that it's not winning right now, but uh, I don't know my opponent's idea. Yeah, now I'll just go rook h2 and rook h7 or rook h6. Um, so the point is this bishop on e4 looks pretty nice, but uh, it can't really attack any of the pawns. <laughs> okay, I'm going to take on this Magnus the best. I don't know why. But we should we should prove this handle wrong. Um, yeah, somebody ah, it was even. No, it was yeah, someone asked in the chat. It's a. Uh, I think if this uh, answer is for Poltak Alvitra on YouTube. So yeah, the, uh, un my answer is that uh, I, bo uh, together, I think uh, it, it's more like uh, you have to understand the position as well, but uh, in some cases you have to just remember. So uh, once again, I will uh, repeat that players uh, who are 900 or 1600 or whatever, try to use the engine as little as possible. And, and then you check your results. And uh, if you lose, it doesn't matter. But it's better to lose than to think uh, you have, uh, you know, by solving the problems by an engine. So that's, that's my Suggestion. Yes, I think knight a5 is the move, and then d6, Venkatesh, yes. Uh, I think Jan is playing, scheduled to play in Norway chess, but of course, these things uh, can change, you know. There's no guarantee sometimes. <laughs> oh, actually, uh, I, I just see in chat that uh, my opponent before uh, before wanted to take the rook, but he blundered. Uh, okay. Yeah, I'm playing uh, Grand Swiss. I'm doing Grand Swiss. Uh, what I mean is, for example, uh, when you follow a live game or when you are seeing banter blitz uh, try to switch off the engine and try to guess the moves of uh, any player or variation so after a while you check it with engine but if you start with engine then your brain doesn't work that's what i mean Okay, f6 straight away blunders uh, the knight on g8. Uh, he could have perhaps uh, played knight a5, bishop f7, king f8, something like that. But now he just uh, loses this piece. Um, for At the moment, uh, the tour, uh, as in the last event, uh, is over. And the finals uh, is scheduled to happen uh, end of September. Um, so we'll see about the next year. Hopefully, I will play. Okay, how to learn openings? 
good question. Um, I believe that uh, you need to, um, as much as you have material on openings, you also need to remember, which means you have to um, go through over the board, not just on computer. I like this Vaishnikov more. <laughs> yes. Yeah, we, we make uh, our opponent change. Uh, his. Oh, but he played a good move. Indeed, this is a good move. A6 is good. We have to give the credit for him. Yeah, that's good. He just missed uh, the move order, I think. Uh, I'm sure that Magnus, the not so best. Thank you, Christian. Thank you. See, just 24 chat has completely different. Just pick any opening which you like. It doesn't matter uh, if it's my course or someone else's course. Just pick and uh, study on the board after you learn it, not before you learn it. Yeah, and I get one more. Okay, he's also low on time, so I don't know why he's playing. Ah, yes, because he's the best. Okay, he wants to, <laughs> it's made in one. Yes, we finally made him change the name, hopefully. Okay, let's play against a player from Philippines, Daryl. So I'll play Sicilian now. Yeah, it is quite important to have a good team of seconds. No, 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 I'm not complaining about uh, just 24 chat. I, I'm just watching. Um, it's going to be tough for uh, Gary in uh, chess 916, in my opinion. Yeah, Moro Gambit is there, then there is, uh, I, I forgot the name of this Gambit, but uh, it's E4, C5, B4. <laughs> um, yeah, I have no idea. I have no idea how it is called. Um, yeah, I prefer uh, over the board uh, for sure. Yeah, I, I didn't face any difficulties, but you know, while playing online, it's always small pressure that uh, you should not um, <laughs> you should not uh, lose your connection and things like that. So that's a small annoying thing. Yeah. Okay, so far it's going good for black. Yeah, I have no idea why I played this move uh, rook b8. Pretty silly. Oh, that's great. Uh, in chat, actually, they did answer one of the questions. Um, I think my mouse slip, actually not just one, I had uh, against Ar Vladislav, I think also in uh, Online Nations Cup, I had one. Yeah, that's uh, one of the things uh, which one has to be careful, of course.
uh, I wouldn't uh, I won't uh, go into um, you know depth, uh, but I will simply say, who has better space? That's one thing uh, which you can always have it in mind. Then uh, bishop pair, obviously it's important. So d4. Okay, let's sacrifice queen. Shall we sacrifice a queen after rook d1? Why not? Let's do it. Yeah, it's wing gambit. Thank you. It's wing gambit. That's correct. E4, C5, B4. And pawn islands. When you have, uh, you know, the double pawn, triple pawn, uh, or pawns are, you know, more islands, then it's not so great. So these things, you can have it in mind. Of course, you know, I'm telling from really the basic, oh, why didn't he take the F2 pawn? I don't have to complain. So this is good. This is good. I like this. Yeah, queen e3 is the best. Oh, g3. Okay, then let's go. All in. That was a bad move. B4. This game is actually pretty interesting. So let's go here. Let's take the pawn. Yeah, but I have to play fast because of the time. Yeah, I got to say I missed that. Uh, okay, let's do it anyways. Doesn't matter. Okay, so this is good. And he's going to play for time now. Come on. <sighs> okay. That was pretty brutal. Yeah, this was uh, in incredible stuff. Um, I like this queen sacrifice one. Okay, let's play Yanur. Actually, I think she she's probably student of French toast. Thank you people for the wishes. B3, why B3? Yeah, it was a pretty interesting game, I, I believe. You see, when I don't play B3, you get such fantastic games. Nice sacrifice, right? Okay, so she's not uh, there. So let me take uh, another challenge. Okay, another one from Turkey, meta heuristic. Okay. Um, so I played D4, E4, Knight F3. Let me try C4 now. Yeah, it's always great to play against Shark, but uh, we will see who is playing against whom uh, depending on the uh, time of play. I had, I played against him so many times. Uh, one thing about gambits is uh, most of the gambits uh, at higher level doesn't really work that well. Uh, maybe something like uh, in 
banter blitz or uh, when you if there is a considerable uh, rating difference it works but uh, at higher level it doesn't So this is pretty much a standard plan in the Catalan. Uh, of course, Srinath would be proud of this thing, what I'm doing here. Um, Okay, Queen's Gambit, there is declined as well as accepted. Both are good. Uh, but what I mean, but nice, nice, nice catch. Uh, the gambits which I am talking about are, you know, you know them. So I know you are pulling my leg, but uh, yeah. All right. All right. Why do I keep getting uh, Robin Van Kampen's uh, advertisement on Chess24 chat? <laughs> King's Gambit. Okay, guys, so it seems King's Gambit is good. So all of you go and watch it. No, I have never got a chance. I never got any chance to play against uh, Gary. It will be awesome. It will be awesome to play. Yeah, my cat is doing good. He moves. Hardly staying in, in the house, roaming all the time. Um, no, I'm, I, I don't watch uh, this cricket. Um, it's slightly longer <laughs> duration, you know. I uh, don't have so much time. To spare. Okay, after all this, I have no idea what I did. I think black is completely fine here. I have an idea to play d5, uh, h6. Well, once again, I invite invite him to play g5 to sacrifice a piece. But this one is a sound one. If my opponent wants, he can take. Uh, Anatoly Karpov, no, I did not. I did not. Yeah, I like uh, French defense a lot. Uh, obviously, I have played it myself uh, in my childhood. Um, and it served me very well. Yeah, Tendulkar is a legend. Um, yeah, game is going a bit slow. I need to do something. I need to do, I need to, I mean, get D5 at some point, but my opponent is not playing C5 and not G5. <laughs> Why Magnus played Candy sometimes? Okay, it works uh, pretty well as a surprise weapon. So if C5, I go D5. Come on, play C5. Uh, next classical is European Club Cup.
Yeah, he's probably thinking if he should go G5, but yeah, he does it. So I sacrifice one more piece. So today is a kind of sacrificing day. Sacrifice more. Okay, I did the sacrifice, but now how do I win this? Let's go. Rook G4. Yeah, perhaps that has some meaning. That Magnus is from Scandinavia. Okay, rook h8 and rook h rook f rook f4, rook h6. Uh huh. But that's why I will go first rook g4, and after king f8, then I go rook f4, and I win the piece. Now if he doesn't have rook, yeah, this is over. Rook d7, oh. Here I have queen b3 and a3. He's losing a piece. Yeah, this was an uh, interesting game. This was interesting game too. Uh, okay, I see some questions. Uh, hello to everyone who is joining now. Um, yeah, it was uh, quite uh, tiring uh, to um, make this uh, time on, of course. But it was also part of my repertoire, so a lot of variations have been already checked and uh, it has been played uh, several times. So it, it helps, it helps a lot. What is this? Okay, let's go. Z, Z Lanza. Okay. Wonder Woman. Okay. Yeah, I'm still playing. Of course, I played Sicilian. Um, I would like to play French if you all are fine. Um, my secret, I mean, I'm having a nice time uh, with all of you, so there's no need for me to go crazy or shout. Of course, I, I'm also winning, <laughs> that's, that's me, that helps, but um, yeah. Get the, oh, this is moderator. I see, I did not know this. Now, actually, uh, I see chess as a, like a game or sport. Um, my opponent can do uh, anything um, as long as he or she doesn't uh, disrespect, uh, you know, or disturb other players. So they can resign, they can uh, play fast, they can play slow, whatever. Yeah, this is the problem with the French. I mean, how do I win this? Uh, so uh, the time and off, uh, I can share a little bit on how to use uh, time and off. I think it's a good question. So uh, for starters, it's uh, best to um, start with the anti-Sicilian, as I anti-Sicilians, as I explained in the course um, at. Uh, let's say 1600 or below, you are most likely to get uh, anti-Sicilians like move number two, b4, b3 or a3 and these kind of things. So as you progress, uh, then of course uh, you need to learn more and that's when you can jump into other variations. So if you just listen to people and uh, go for the absolute main lines and uh, 
do these things, uh, it's, it's only going to make you confused. Um, I can, I can troll. <laughs> yeah, but uh, it seems she's a Wonder Woman, so I got to be careful. So bishop g5, yeah, that's good. So f6, queen e6, check. So very tricky, very tricky. Um, okay, I have to be careful here in what I'm talking as well as in what I'm playing. Yeah, what is Alekin battery? What does, what is this? Okay, so William Frisbee gives you the advantage. E5, that's the way to go. Okay, G3 is something which I did not expect uh, because uh, obviously I can go knight f5 or I can, yeah, let me go knight g6 to see where she will go. I see battery. Okay, let's uh, move the bishop from here so that I can get my knight f6. No, no, e5 is actually quite challenging. Uh, that's, uh, that it's not a joke, but plus equal is uh, too soon. I do not think uh, Jan Nepomnia, she will play French in uh, Dubai. That's too optimistic. Okay, 92. By the way, I think this is a very good example on how to play against uh, against exchange French. So it's a free free lesson. Actually, uh, I played against Wesley so uh, maybe in two thousand ten or even before because he he used to play um, in Asian events back then. And uh, yeah, we had uh, pretty interesting games. Of course, after he moved to US, he, he became a, a very strong top player, uh, world number two. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, if the bishop is on G2 here, a bishop is on G2, that's uh, pretty much okay. Oh, she blundered. She blundered here. Okay. So king g1, now I go, I will play knight g4 and followed by knight h4, maybe even. Uh, the reputation of uh, French isn't that great. Um, it might, it's not that uh, French is losing, but uh, it's, it's tough. And why would you want to choose such an opening in uh, an important, match okay ah just trash talker let's trash talk him yeah i did lost uh, some games in panther blitz i think uh, maybe even the previous panther blitz Uh, Chess Olympiad is going to be online, obviously. No, 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 no. <laughs> He's moderator, of course not. Okay, where is the trash talker? Okay, he trash talker left. So I'm gonna accept some other. Okay, this one is, 
Aryan Ujwal Mehta. That's an Indian name, but uh, he, his flag suggests Malaysia. So C4, D4, E4, Knight F3 is over. Um, let's try B4. Yeah, they are going to play something new in Dubai for sure. Uh, it's just unsure. I mean, I'm not, I, I do not know uh, which opening, as in they have played like Sicilian, if I've all these things several times. Yeah, seriously thinking just what's that? Oh, already played. This seems like an improved version of B3, right? Because already my pawn has reached B4. Then Telugu stream just a two turn star. Yeah, should I go crazy now? Okay, let's do this. Now I'm going to play g5, h4. This is actually quite promising here. Um, yeah, it's pretty normal to get nervous. There's nothing to, uh, nothing that is unusual. I think uh, almost every player, uh, you know, faces such things. Uh, what you can do is uh, you can try to figure why you were nervous, like which move bothered you. That way um, it helps you to play better next time. <laughs> yeah, I was talking to them, but uh, they said uh, everyone can hear. I wasn't sure. No, <laughs> no, 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 Sachin, no, no. Get into winning position, but uh, um, uh, just try to um, think of uh, your opponents as similar rating. Maybe that can help. Okay, here I did something and it seems pretty bad. Yeah, I have no idea what I did to my position. Yeah, something like reverse time or not. Okay, let's uh, you, look. Okay, we can have a poll uh, if I should uh, play Bonclod or not. And uh, we can decide in a democratic way. Yeah, because uh, I think people are fed up with Bonclot, if I'm not mistaken, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. Type one. No, but there should be also option no Bonclot. So type two. <laughs> type two for not. And only one what? Okay. Spam as in you cannot type the same person, man. So queen b3 check seems uh, good to me. Okay, two is for, no, don't play. Okay, then type two. Okay, I don't know what's this three means. I mean, that's too smart. Okay, so, uh, yeah. Now I kind of like my position. Why do I like it? Ah, it's, oh no. Oh, no, 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 no draw, no draw. 
So it's too soon. It's too soon, my friend. Ah, three is for trolls and zero. Okay. Yeah, battery hopefully will manage to create a poll. Yes or no? Okay, it's up to you. I mean, I give you the chance to decide. My faith. Yes, the, like somehow uh, my opponent was doing well, but then he started thinking quite, he, he took a lot of time. So which is, which is not good. So let's go and attack this knight on e6. Uh, yeah, oh, 3c5 uh, is interesting, definitely, and uh, actually less explored, so you can surprise your opponent quite nicely. Oh, no, people, what are you doing? No, no, have it on YouTube, too. That's the only way we can <laughs> crash the bone clock. Um, so rookie seven, okay, what should I do now? I'm losing a pawn. Okay, I got to play fast. It's enough. Oh, finally. Finally, I got him. Yeah, now it's just winning. Okay, now it's all pre move. What happened to the pole? Uh, okay, when I by the time you decide, I will accept my next challenge. Okay, short leash. Let's keep 64%, but where is the... <laughs> but okay, but YouTube, I think is more of uh, not, right? Uh, but I have a friend called who likes A4. This, this is also not very interesting. Okay, I can play without castling if that counts as legit. All right, I will play, I will play. Stop it, stop it, please. I think this guy knows that I'm going to play bonkers. Yeah, so far I'm just playing uh, reversed modern kind of a thing. People, what will you learn if I play queen down? You won't learn anything. Like this, you will see nice sacrifice. You know, the, the sacrifice with queen, isn't that great?
No, I, I think it in India, uh, game is, I mean, chess is in schools or it's going to be. Um, but I think over a period of time, a uh, lot of youngsters um, improved and so on. Yeah, I'm playing no castling. I think this is this is fair, fair deal, right? <clears throat> Although I could have taken the B7 pawn, yeah, and I will take this B7 pawn. And then I will come back to a three. Aha, uh -huh, 95. Okay, take it. Rook c1. So, yeah, king is actually not bad on f1 uh, because with king on g1, bishop d6 would have been bad news. So, knight b3. Yeah, knight b3. No, 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 no. I will never play a4. So, if the knight goes back to f3, um, it's possible, but I thought uh, I can go knight c4, knight b3. And I think my opponent just blundered this pawn here. Yeah, if if he could uh, uh, bring the knight to c3, yeah, it, it, it would be great, but I am I would not allow that. Yeah, now just queen a1, king g2, and bring the rooks. No, what is this? This is rigging. <laughs> I mean, just 24 says, please say, please answer yes. Come on, guys, defeat them, defeat them. Uh, no, we watch uh, movies on uh, Netflix and Amazon. I saw this movie, Timurasu, I think it was just brilliant. It's a Telugu movie. Oh no, that's a lot of words. That doesn't seem good. This doesn't seem really good for me. <laughs> Why did you decline Magnus Queensek, Dutch defender? Yeah, but... I mean, please answer no. Oh no, that's a lot of words. I mean, more words, it's not good for the current government. Oh, 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 queen c7, no. Um, okay, let's, I can go knight d4, knight c6. Ah, there is queen d6, ooh. I did not see that. But luckily I have this and bishop g2. Yeah, I think, uh, yeah, somehow this is, going to be bad i i already can feel it but didn't you enjoy the queen sack you know that's tough when i played bone cloud i'm still trying to influence still have time yeah queen d6 is a good move but the thing is uh, black really can't move the bishop on c7 because of queen c8 I don't know what's the name of that opening, but uh, I did have I I did cover that opening in my time and of course so. And uh, when I have this uh, poll, I can't see your chat. How do I minimize this? Ah, cl no, close poll. Is it close poll? Probably.
Now, f4, e3, bishop was hanging. But when you are a piece up, you just play simple chess. And also, I'm winning the rook here on e7. Okay, 70 words is ridiculous. Oh, queen. Okay, let's take the queen. I think uh, battery will stop the count only when uh, it... What? 81%? That's insane. I should have given some other opening. I shouldn't have told... Uh, Yes or no, something like Ewan's Gambit, King's Gambit, and so on. Okay, that was fine. Yeah, before I, I yeah, Grob is like, yeah, it's too much. So somebody just give me white, please. Okay, let's do it against dangerous, right? It's not so dangerous. Uh, oh, he's good. This is good. This is good stuff. This a4 move doesn't threaten me. Okay. This is at least, he's a uh, he's good person. Actually, I did get a nice stonewall Dutch. Now all I need to do is just bring the rook, king g8, c6, bishop d7, bishop e8, bishop h5. Yeah, Ivan's gambit is quite interesting, and uh, you know, such a such an interesting uh, opening. Yeah, I I think uh, battery was voting on behalf of everyone. I think this poll was rigged. We should not give this. We should not give bishop pair so easily. Ah, this is not. This is a very interesting way he's playing. Should go 94 probably. Yeah, just take this. Yeah, here dangerous can be really dangerous. I underestimate it. Yeah, generally it's not advisable to play bomb cloud, you know. It's, uh, it used to be mainly for the content, you know, it's, uh, it's not really a nice way. Yeah, d4, knight f6, wow. Okay, I really, really made him angry. I can see that. No, he's today very dangerous. Yeah, I think this is not uh, this is not a good position uh, from any. Okay, this is the time I can get rid of. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, this is not crazy. Yeah, he found it. Uh oh, this is, I'm going down here. Oh, okay. 
I have some chance now. All right, let's take this. And let's take this. Rook C8. Okay, now it's not so bad. This is already good news. Ah, okay, this is good. Awesome. Yeah, this we can survive. Oh, he was low on time. This was uh, pretty. Yeah, when you are just winning, go for this. Yeah, I think uh, I was completely lost. After, yeah, I missed Queen D4. Yeah, he, he, okay, I, I changed my opinion. So there you go. Okay, let's play against. Uh, I mean, some of them are challenging me once again. Okay, so Wank Chess, let's play against him. No, 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 my opponent did resign. All right, so let's try to get King's Gambit, if e4, e5. Yes, <laughs> I mean, why would I spoil my beautiful opportunity of castling? Okay, I do hope that he didn't study any of the courses. Oh, he, he does know his stuff. Yeah, A4 is the uh, best weapon against Bong Cloud Dangerous, right? Agreed. This time, you were right. You were dangerous. Yeah, so King's Gambit. So I think D4 is the right way. Knight D5. So if White managed to get get the, win this uh, F4 pawn, that's that's good enough. Of course, that's the whole problem here. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. I don't know, to be honest, why uh, he didn't go for it. But I thought he should go for knight d5, yes. Absolutely. So in endgame, obviously, the pawns on d4, c, uh, c2 uh, are like much better placed. And that's the reason why I exchanged uh, light square bishop. So of course he wants to get e5, e4. So let's keep it this way. I probably could have played knight d to knight e4. Maybe that was better. Yeah, and uh, also uh, viewers, if you like today's banter bridge, uh, we are. Uh, I will also do another one uh, tomorrow. So if you missed today, you have a shot at playing against me tomorrow, and uh, same time, uh, three p.m. So should I go rookie one or what should I do here? Okay, let's take this. That was a strange decision. I thought rook f5, e5 made a lot of sense, but okay. Uh, 
well when you can't cast it anyways it doesn't really matter right yeah i thought rook f5 was uh, the way to play so c4 now we we will see the advantage of having this uh, you know d and c in end games the double pawns are not the best because they can't move now i'm just going to play d5 d6 Therefore, one important thing is if you have like kingside majority, as you can see here, it's better to have some pieces to, to be able to play g5, g4. And with less pieces, I'm not, uh, you know, worried about it. So, yeah, I, I think he just blundered. Yeah, d takes e7, g takes f3, both are winning. So I'm, I'm just going to capture this. Yeah, King's Gambit works well. I haven't studied the uh, Jan's course yet, but maybe I should. Uh, my courses are on sale currently, I hope. Let me check once. Uh, they are on uh, Chessable. If you go to chessable.com, you will find all my courses. There are three courses. Yeah, currently they are on sale. Okay, so let's take one last game. Okay, this boy is serious. Once. Yeah, endings are painful, that's true. Because it ends after that. If you make one mistake, it's over. Uh, knight c6 allows c4. I don't know if that was intentional or not, but why would you do such a thing? Normally this knight on d4 goes to b5, a3 and come uh, to c2. And here my opponent gave, uh, straight away so this is much better version thank you dj i'm happy to hear that you like the course ah it's just trash talker okay yeah somehow uh, I, I i accepted your challenge but uh, somehow you couldn't move Yeah, hopefully all of you can join uh, tomorrow as well. And my idea is pretty simple to go rook f. Okay, I should have probably went queen uh, to d2. So queen d7. Um, Okay, let's go to B1. I'm setting up a small nasty thread. I would say if you want to improve your end games, uh, you can check out the end game, but if you are particular on French or Taimanov, you can check out um, the opening courses. It's up to you. Uh, I like all of them, but obviously you know better on which uh, which thing to buy. 
So what is this bishop e2, bishop g7 seems to me winning, right? Because I have queen h6 after bishop. Okay, so yeah, I think he kind of missed it, yeah. Yeah, now it's pretty straightforward. I, uh, I'm i gonna attack the d6 pawn. By the way, who is this uh, mod, <laughs> no skill, only luck? <laughs> it's very funny. <laughs> okay, Alec in battery, that's a deal. <laughs> so yeah, I will, I will accept. Yeah. I mean, when you are pieced down, uh, just don't exchange pieces, you know, obviously it helps the player who has more pieces. <laughs> See that, that's a very funny reply. <laughs> I, I like a lot of world champions. I learned uh, a lot from uh, each of them, uh, different concepts. Uh, all of them have, uh, you know, uh, quite different approach. Uh, oh, he blundered a piece. Okay, so that was gentlemen, Vansh Pandya. So that is it uh, for today's Banter Blitz and uh, see you tomorrow uh, uh, at the same time. And uh, if you like this, if you like this stream, do join uh, tomorrow as well. And uh, we'll have fun games and uh, hopefully no bomb cloud <laughs> and have some, uh, you know, Kings Gambit, uh, some nice, uh, nice uh, openings. So have a wonderful time. Good evening or good morning, wherever, whichever part of the world you are from. Take care. Want to raise your chest to a new level? Challenge Yourself is an exclusive, innovative experience designed for Chess24 Premium members. Train like a champ with a unique set of lessons prepared by the coaches of the challengers. Boris Gelfin and co. will help you improve your chess. Play a champ. Play a Grandmaster each day in Banter Blitz. Take advantage of this incredible opportunity from June 10th. Go premium and challenge yourself.